going on, my little sun bunnies? We're back at SeaWorld of Texas for Labor Day weekend. Red, white, and barbecue. We're going to check it out. Here we are. SeaWorld. Temperature about 86 degrees. Wind <laughs> almost non existent. You can see the Texas flag moving, the U.S. flag is not. doesn't always run. Uh, as you can see, they have operating hours for it because of, uh, of our water restrictions that we have here in San Antonio. We've been, uh, we've been getting some rain though lately for sure. All right, guys, we are at SeaWorld of Texas for Labor Day weekend on a Friday, mind you. And there are some people here, but it's not that packed. Uh, of course, there's the water parks open and SeaWorld's open right now. So some people are going to the water park. Some people are going to SeaWorld. We're going to SeaWorld. Diane's over there standing in line to see what we can. Uh, normally, when you get in line, when you come as a season pass holder, you go here and you get your uh, free commodities. So that's what we're going to do right now. But ladies and gentlemen, we're the start of our freaking vlogging back up again. Starting at SeaWorld of Texas in San Antonio with the red, white, and barbecue celebration. We're going to go have lunch out here, see what's going on, and uh, bring it to you live. So without any further ado, let's get going. Good, how you doing? Doing well, this is Azul. Azul? Hello Azul, Azul. how are you? You are you a beautiful <laughs> little guy. How old is that guy? He's 26. 26 and they live to? 80, sometimes even 100. Wow, lifelong, lifelong companion there, man. For sure, so we always encourage you if you're ever thinking about getting a bird, definitely do your research and take into account how long you can live. Absolutely. <laughs> well, Azul, thank you for stopping by and being on my vlog. <laughs> you have a good one. All right, guys. Park map. It's a fairly large park. I would say it's as large as uh, all right guys, here it is. Sea World of Texas right here. This is what we're gonna do right here, guys. So we're gonna come here and have a little bit of a, uh, a little bit of food. Oh, this is gonna be a spooky, the square pumpkin maze. Check out this guy. He's moving along. Algebra Island. That's what this is. There he is. The other one is over here. Let's see, I don't know if you can see her. 
go over there. Aldubra Island. And they're separated. So there's two of them right there. Separated for some reason between here and over there. So. And I guess the next one will be down that way. Looking at the map. We're in Hawaii here and we're going to have some Hawaiian food. Alright, first stop, Hawaiian Uli Uli Chicken Pie with Jasmine Rice and uh, and uh, what did you say? Pineapple. And pineapple in it. Looks like they gave us some. So we're going to go ahead and give this a shot. Let you know how this is. Sea World of Texas, red, white, and barbecue. Ending this weekend. Alright guys, man, that is awesome. Uh, I can't even remember the name of it. That chicken is really good. And the rice is really good. Everything about it is really good, man. It's really really mixes with Uli Uli. Uli Uli! Mixed good with the with the rice, that jasmine rice, man. Wow, it was good. So we took out some of that. Teriyaki sauce. The teriyaki is good. So we get seven of these. So we've used one. So we're going to go to every station and go around and vlog it all for us. So. All right, so that was good. That was a Hawaiian barbecue. Now we're looking for the, uh, well, here's a Lone Star Bar in DJ Times right here. This is the bar that is here. Let me take you up there. Nobody there. See what San Antonio, baby. So if you want to get your drink on, this is the place to do it. Remember, there you go. Five cents for a pack of 40 bucks. But you can see the price earlier, that's a good price. We, however, ended up with seven because we're platinum members. So this is our second stop at Kansas City. We'll see how that is. Kansas City Barbecue, the burnt end sandwich with a cheese cornbread, cheese cornbread and a piece of corn. There you go. Let's try it out. Let's try it taste. All right, all in all, it's very good. It's got a little spice to it, man. That barbecue sauce. It's got a little kick. Very good. I'll tell you what. We got the seven pack. That's only, that's only our second one. We need to tell me we got five more plates to go, guys. Can we do it? I don't know. This one's good, though, guys. Kansas City Barbecue. Red, white, and barbecue. Labor Day weekend. Sea World of Texas. Hi, right, guys. Look what I found. You come to Sea World and you want to know what the height requirements are for all the rides. There you go. 
All right, this is a Halloween prop. It looks like stuffed animals, but I'm sure it's gonna be like a, a jack in the box. We get some Spice Girls in the background too. All right, this is pretty sad. I've been here about eight times. We came here the opening day that Catapult Falls open. We rode it. And every time we've been here since, it's been closed. It's pretty sad, SeaWorld. Come on, man, what's going on with this ride? Another prop. They're getting ready for a hollow screen. We'll be here for opening night. Here's another prop, so I don't know what's gonna be in here. It's gonna be cool though. There's another prop. We're getting ready for Halloween, guys. Hollow Scream is coming to SeaWorld. It's the arcade. We have vlog here, man. You wanna play some games? That's the thing. SeaWorld does have a, does have a game park. Like the Hollywood Studios does. Toy Story Land, which I think they're gonna tear down, aren't they? I think they're talking about getting rid of the, the Toy Story Land there. Luigi, Mario, Donkey Kong. I bet you get some guy gonna jump out of there, huh? Ha <laughs> Hello Scream! Coming to San Antonio, Texas! There's three white guys going up. I won't ride that no more. But I did ride it on an opening day. So, I got that under my belt. Alright, we found Carolina Barbecue. Let's go check it out. See what it's all about. Found it, guys. Carolina barbecue. I got the barbecue pit right there. You wearing that black dress, coat and cowboy boots. He was there, but I didn't care. Too busy staring at you. In the pouring rain, with the blue lights flashing in the hills of Appalachia. Your prices if you want to get yourself a drink here. Unfortunately, they're not open right now. All right, this looks like a pulled pork mm -hmm. sandwich with some coleslaw from and you Carolina. Get, you can have it in your sandwich if and you want. And we're gonna put it in the sandwich and we're gonna chomp it up and let you know how it goes. Hey guys, members, $40, we get seven stops, man. This is our third stop. So, man, if you're real hungry, you can go for a seven. If it, I mean, that's a lot of food for one person. Mm -hmm. All right, let's try it out. We'll let you know. It's a lot of pressure let's, for let's two let people. Diane, let's let the Diane bang into it. Oh my goodness, look at that pulled pork. Ladies and gentlemen, would you look at that? That's how you eat a pulled pork sandwich right there. <laughs> She's a pro, man, like me. Let me dig into that bad boy. Here's all, here's all the people that want to be in Texas right now. You heard it from the man. Sit, guys. Oh, good, man. Oh, yeah.
I've never been. Look at this place, man. What is this? Look, thirsty. Oh, it's pretty. It's pretty gruesome, doesn't it? You get in there, you're gonna get all. It's probably gonna be a bar. Bloodthirsty. You're gonna have some people up there, probably hanging out in the trees. Some guy right there, scare you. It's gonna be fun. Open your night. This is called the cool zone. Apparently because I got a lot of fans there. Let's go through this bad boy and see how much, how cool it is. This is their wooden coaster here. They are getting ready for Halloween. Getting ready for Halloween. Check it out, guys. We didn't we didn't expect we were gonna get some Halloween gear here, did we? No, we didn't. I think there's another one over here. Sure enough. There's a whole bunch of stuff over here. They are getting ready for Halloween, guys. Check it out. Diane and I have already decided we're going to go ahead and renew our pass here because I thought it was a great deal. We've got some great, gotten some great things out here. This is the Sea Lion Otter slash Walrus Stadium right here called Pacific Point. And you go up through here. I think there's a show going on right now, if I'm not mistaken. Now this is a little ice house. You can buy some Coke products and walk up there and hang out. That's well, going to be cool. There's what is Orca Stadium, which I refer to as Shamu Stadium. Because when it opened, Shamu was the big thing here. Of course. It might not be the perfect time or place, but she put amazing back in your face. Then you think she's everything that you can learn. It's another great day to be a seawalt of Texas. It's about 90 degrees, 93 degrees. What's going on here, man? New stand. Another prop for hollow scream. 
Check it out. You want to get you a jalapeno? My jalapeno is on my shoulder on a Disney Cruise Line, right? You guys know who jalapeno is if you watch the vlogs. We're gonna have a stage show here. This is where they had the FX show, man, over there. Memphis barbecue, baby. It's got you some Memphis style jazz music. I don't know what Diana's getting. I'm gonna bet she's gonna get. Uh, I don't know. Now we're having Memphis barbecue dry rub ribs. Right here with a little bit of corn, a little bit of slaw. What do you think? Is it gonna be good? They've all been good so far. Let's dig and let you know. All right, that was good, man. The band's good. The food is good. That was uh, that was good too, man. The dry rub ribs were good. The corn was good, and I don't know what that other stuff was. I mean the. Uh, the like coleslaw was good, but the corn was, I don't know what's mixed with it, but it was very good. So definitely, something to check out, man. Red, white, and barbecue, SeaWorld of Texas. We got the Kula chicken here in the Maui Maui wrapped in banana and it's banana leaves and it's going to be uh, looking like it's going to be good. These are our last two plates of the day. Number six and number seven. We came back to Hawaii because we thought they had the best of the bunch. So here we are. We're going to try and we'll let you know. All right. All in all, the Maui Maui and the banana uh, was delicious wrapped in the banana and then this uh, the banana pill and this chicken is delicious all in all I think Hawaii blew away all of them man hate to say it but Hawaii is the champion of today's meal challenge SeaWorld red white and barbecue and the winner goes to Hawaii number 50 ladies <laughs> and gents so, hey, good, good food, man. They had a good time. Sea World of San Antonio. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We love you. Remember, come back. We got a lot more coming in the next 18 months. This is just the start of it. Summer's about over. It's still hot as hell here, but summer's almost over. We're ready to rock. We're ready to roll. We're going to put some more content on the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. We love you. Hug somebody you love. Peace.